Hang on, I'll drive. Sniper, top of the tower. We done? Shit. Got all excited There's a weapons there. case over here. Got a reference here to a large cartel prison at a village called Rosario. They keep a lot of rebel sympathizers there. Even the sloppiest prisons keep records. Yeah. The warden's office might have intel on some of these people who disappeared. Let's check it out. I got it. I'll fly. Hey. Punch it, man. Ready? Fire, fire, fire. We'll go. Engage it. Get that clear over here. God, these fuckers are sloppy. Got some questions for you, asshole. Okay, okay. There's this one thing I heard about. with this size operation. The jail cells unlock automatically when the power goes out. So we take out the Jenny. We gotta find it first. Come on. Yo, we got a weapons case here. Looks like we've riled them up. Back it up, they're gonna see you.
We're good, we're good. Careful, Sicario sporting a submachine gun. The HQ building, inside. Hey, sniper on the roof. Get down before they see you. I got a narco over here. There, by the container. off. Jenny's down. Those cell doors must be unlocked. Let's talk to one of these prisoners. See what we can find out about the disappearances. Hey, I need your help with something. We've been trying to figure out what happens to the people who disappear in San Mateo. What happens to them is... El Pozolero. Stewmaker? But what does he do with the bodies? Where are they? He takes the corpses and stuffs them into oil drums, then covers them with lejia. What's the English? Lie. Caustic soda. Si. Sosa caustica. Within a few days, the bodies in the oil drums well. There are no bodies left to find. So now we've got a name, we need more info on El Pozolero. A way to go after him. He's the only one who can lead us to any of the remains. I think that's all of them. List the location of a cartel combination they're awarding to some guy who killed a few rebels. I'm engaging tanks settling down. Must think we backed off. Clear. How are you guys holding up? We're settling down. Must think we backed off. Good to go. Target carrying submachine guns. Puto. 
hornet's nest. The rebels need supplies badly. And that chopper's got them. Let's snag that bird and get it turned in the right direction. That LT's getting away. Oh, here we go. They've seen us. Oh, hell. Well, there's always another chopper out there somewhere, right? What the hell are you doing? Take cover. The drone is up. We're nice. Watch out. All ass before that thing blows. Grenade! Grenade! Just stay down, I'll be right there. God damn it, it's close. Hostile down. Grenade, move! Get down, chopper! I got eyes in a weapons case. Alarm over here. Shut the damn alarm off. I got eyes in a mounted weapon. We're clear. According to this, a journalist named Lupe Vera has been investigating the disappearances in San Mateo. She's caused enough trouble that the cartel's gonna make her disappear next. We've got her 20. Let's get to her before the Sicarios do. Got a 20 on a cartel network station. Let's knock it out. some intel? Go on without me. I've got the bike. Cartel just put up a wall and turned the whole village into a prison. What's the play? Same as before. 
Get inside, find the warden's office, search for intel on the missing people. There have to be answers behind those walls. Let's move. Engaging hostiles. Coopere total saldra bien. Keep it quiet. They know we're here. Got some questions for you, asshole. Okay, okay. There's this one thing I heard about. Time to dust off our chopper flying skills. Got a 20 in the cartel machine that needs delivering to the rebels. I called the rebels for reinforcements. Copy. A fire team message. Fuck. Sniper. I got the C4 primed. Taking fire from the camp entrance. be the warden's office. If there are any prisoner records, they'll be in there. Wait. Grenade! That's gotta be the warden's office. If there are any prisoner records, they'll be in there. We need to get inside and see what we can find. Got it on. The alarm. 
alarm is disabled. The alarms are disabled. Reinforcements won't be flying in. Alert's over, let's get back to work. Clean up and move on. You want to check this spot out for intel? Got a PC over here. If there's a record of the prison's inmates, it's here. No time to be choosy. We'll download every document. Download started. Stay alert, people. Download complete. Let's exfil and get the data to Bowman. Hopefully there's something here we can use. A Bolivian journalist named Lupe Vera has been investigating the disappearances in San Mateo for several months. Track her down and find out what she knows.
inside of the cage. They know we're here. Their ult is escaping. There's a weapons case over here. Enemy marked. fire on these shitheads. Nice job. Cutting the cartel chatter will make things easier for rebel operations. journalist named Lupe Vera has been investigating the disappearances in San Mateo for several months. Track her down and find out what she knows. We'll leave a marker so the rebels can pick up these supplies later. Clear over here. up on the journalist's last known location. Let's track her down and find out what she knows about the missing people. We gotta figure the cartels around, looking for her too. Hola, camaradas. What do you want, gringo? We're looking for a journalist named Lupe Vera. So are we, but it's too late. The cartel has her. They've taken her back to her base. 
You planning a rescue? Yes, but it would be suicide. The outpost is heavily guarded and I don't have enough troops. You do now. You need to get the Vera. Whatever it takes. Then let's go. We haven't got much time. Anden, hermanos. I got, eyes I got on the one sniper. narco. The sandbag in placement. See? Got another tango. I'm spotting another tango. We got rebels throwing down with the cartel. What's our play? Shit, they spotted us. You the journalist? Me llamo Lupe Vera. But I don't know if I'll stay with journalism after this shit. To whom do I owe my rescue? We're working with Pakatari. We need any info you got on the people who are disappearing. There is a rebel safe house near here. Everything I have on Los Desaparecidos is there. Then let's go get it. Clear on this side. are being taken from all over Bolivia, not just by the cartel. Unidad is also involved. Some officers torture and murder innocents. The hideout is just ahead. Good. Show us that intel on the people disappearing in San Mateo. We need to put a stop to it. It's not hard to guess that Los Desaparecidos, the disappeared, have all been murdered. I've got notes on some truck the cartel uses to pick up the bodies. It's supposed to have a regular route like a fucking garbage service. That's it? What about its route, its schedule? Nothing specific. Oye, amigo, this was hard enough to get as it is. I just know that the truck's last stop is a place where the cartel gets rid of the bodies. What about my story? There are dozens of families, hundreds, who need answers to what happened to their loved ones. When we get answers, you'll be the one to spread the word. Adios. And gracias. I'm going to wait here for Pacatari. You should find that truck. Nomad, I've gone through those files you snagged in Rosario. There's nothing on the missing people in there. Is there anything on El Pozolero? We've got a description of the truck that makes his regular deliveries, but nothing on the truck's route or its schedule. It's like this truck just roams the countryside, and anybody put in the back just vanishes. Well, it isn't supernatural. 
Here, the Rosario's files have info on the truck's route. I'm sending it to you now. Get your mitts on the driver and make him tell you his final destination. That's where all the remains will be. Got it. According to our intel, there's a cartel death truck that collects corpses across San Mateo and delivers them to someone called El Pozolero. Intercept the truck and force the driver to give up El Pozolero's location. Fire. I copy. Take it a shot. Eyes on the truck. Meet this fucker alive. He's already pulled up. Escort has been destroyed. Escort vehicle is destroyed. Gasoline secure. Ready for the rebels to come get it. That's what I call a full service outfit. I'm unarmed! I'm unarmed! You El Pozolero? For serious? Shh. Fuck no! I'm not that Diablo! I, I just drive the truck way, nada más! Tell me his name and where to find him. His name's Raul something. Raul Morillo. You sure you want me to tell you where he is? Motherfucker, tell me where El Pozolero is. I ran out of patience two days ago. All right! I'll tell you where he is! Pero, you know, we should never found out. Bowman, this is no man. The driver gave us El Pozolero's real name, Raul Murillo. He also gave up Pozolero's location. Outstanding. I'll run Murillo's name and send you whatever background I can find. This one's weird, Bowman. These cartel goons are staying away from El Pozolero like he's got the plague. That might be why there's such little chatter about him. Be careful. There's a lot of unknowns here. Make sure he's alive. Otherwise, we'll never get confirmation on these missing people. Got a file transfer from Bowman. When I was a kid, we used to live over the train tracks. Every time a train went past, I would run into my mother's bed, and she'd assure me there was no such thing as monsters. She was such a liar. El Pozolero, also known as the Stewmaker. Sometimes the cartel needs a dead body to completely disappear without a trace. In such cases, they ship the cadavers off to San Mateo. The first thing El Pozolero does is place the bodies inside a barrel, which he fills with caustic soda, sodium hydroxide, then covers the drums, stirring occasionally. After 24 hours, there's nothing left but a thick sludge, a stew. He pours this into a pit. Any leftover teeth or bone fragments, he smashes into dust. Last year, more than 300 people disappeared in San Mateo. Their families have no idea if their loved ones are alive or dead. They can't have proper burials. They can't have closure. The only one who knows what truly happened to these people is El Pozolero, the monster who melted them. able to dig up some background on El Pozolero. I don't like this. We got no idea what we've got a location on El we're walking into. I'm getting like tension, man. Eh? Kinda like a little nervous. Like Bowman said there are a lot of variables in play. There aren't a lot of variables. We just don't know what they are, so we're taking everything into account. We need a covert way in. I want to see El Pozolero before he sees us. Coming up on the cartel base now. Let's go find El Pozolero. You guys smell that? Christ, the fuck is it? Death, man. Fucking death. Hey, Down. sniper in the move. 
We got a Sicario. Around the parking area. I got eyes on El Pozolero. Remember, we need him alive. Man of Cereba, let me see those hands. Hola, senores. You're taller than the usual delivery people. Wait. Que pedo. Ya nos chingaron. Ya valió madres. Which way is supposed to go off? Yo, I got a weapons case here. Coming with us, fuckface. Why are you angry with me? Estoy traba. Inigo Morales, district court judge, disappeared on his way home from work. Octavio Rodriguez, student activist, kidnapped by a gang of armed men outside a local bar, never seen again. Mirabel Castro, school teacher, last seen at an Unidad checkpoint in Santa Cruz. I remember her. She had beautiful skin, like an angel. There's a thousand more like them in this stack, you son of a bitch, and that's just this year. Every one of them had a family. People out of their minds with grief because their loved ones are gone. But they were dead. What else could I do? Midas thinks he's got the mind of a child. Probably has no idea what you're talking about. Well, he better have a fucking photographic memory. I want the names of every single person you put in one of those drums. I don't care how long it takes. Do you understand me? Yes. Okay. Then you will take me back, verdad? I must get back to work. I can handle stupid and I can handle grim. But I sure don't like seeing them in one package. He's not exactly stupid. He's emotionally underdeveloped. He didn't learn the proper way to react to the dead. Like his brain broke? He's disassociating. Exactly. I, for one, am not gonna let my kids burn ants anymore. El Mudo was going to try to kill me, just as I was going to kill him. Black is for vengeance. White is for safety. Gold is for success. Ahora, I ask you, how can any saint grant contradictory prayers from two different men? It has been my experience that gods always side with the man who has the most money, the most men, and the most power. I had lost the one man I could always trust, mi hermano. How many men would be more loyal to him than to me? How much power would he take? Would that be enough for him to take me out? I would always have an advantage, though. I grew up with the man. I knew how his mind worked. I knew his next move before he did. I just had to be patient. 